Don't you just love it when somebody else tries to tell you what you can and can't do type of thing? And then God sends somebody your way to set the record straight. This viewer came under my video titled, How About That? I, be, I made it June the 3rd, and on Saturday, they came in the comments, and they said, What's her name on YouTube? Because she don't know what happened. Mike, Mike ain't lying. What do he need to lie for? She can keep his name out of stuff and stop worrying about him. It ain't her place. So, being the person I am, I gave her the information. And I told her, I says, the one you can see who she says she talks to Mike's brother, she has two names. And I gave her both her names. She said she claims to live in South Chicago. Then she claims that I'm is part of 051. But she can't even say it correctly. She says 051. The one you can't see is Stephanie Peterson. Then the lady comes back and she says, well, Mike only has two brothers. Which one did she say? I said, she didn't. She just kept throwing shade at me because I posted the balloon release that was sent to me. And his auntie did say to share it. I said, let me get you the link. And so I did proceed to get her the link. And then I got her another link to show her what Conley Jacobs had to say about Mike and his death. And then I let her know where exactly in the video she had something to say about Mike and stuff, including his father. Now, y'all may be wondering who that person is that I'm talking to. Well, over here on my other video that I posted on the third about Mike, she had commented underneath another comment where somebody is calling me a liar for saying Mike had nothing to do with Kanika's death. And she come under here and she's telling that person also. Actually, she's not. So if he didn't do nothing, he left before anything happened, so shut up. And what do you know? She just actually responded again, saying that his daddy didn't pass away. Because I told her, I at this point in the video, she was saying Big Mike had passed away. She just says anything. There we go. This makes it easier. First time she commented to me, she said, his n real name is Michael Tate, which I was aware of, but I didn't know who she was and didn't know if she was being, you know, just one of those people that want to come in and talk like, you know, they know something or not. So I said, yes, I do know who, what his name is. I you know, know a lot about his family. And then she informed me that she, his kid's mother is her auntie. Then she told me about his funeral being on Saturday. And his kids being 11 and 4. The little girl is 11 and the son is 4. And then she talked about old Goofy over there. Because of her saying, oh, she talks to his brother. She wants to know which brother you talking to. 
so she can go let him know what you're saying. And that's where she said that his daddy did not pass away. So, while you busy over there talking your talk like you think you know something, bet you didn't know, bet you didn't know. And again, she just came back and commented again. She says, and people believe her when she's not telling facts. They just lies. People believe anything on the internet. When I knew him personally, I always used to see him. And I said, that is the sad part about this case. Folks say anything for attention. 